I'm Suzanne Ridgway. This is Let Us Eat. Welcome to my channel. I'm in my car and my husband is driving me to a different Dollar Tree store over in Columbia County, New York. And I have not been to that one in a really long time, if not at all, so I'm very, very excited to go check it out. Tomorrow is my husband David's birthday, so in the comments below, make sure you tell him happy birthday and subscribe. Thank you so much to all the new people who joined me in the past few days subscribing to my channel. I know I'm going to reach that 300 goal in no time at all with everyone's help. I'm so excited. I've got another collaboration video. That said, let's look for that new subscribe word and click on it. Give this video a big thumbs up and tap that bell so YouTube will notify you when I upload a new video. Mother's Day stuff. They make really great baskets with the Dollar Tree gift sets. Look how cute. Protect your little one. Fun in the sun. Some of the new items. I'm going to dive right in. I am home now, and when you walk into the Columbia County Dollar Tree, the new holiday stuff is on a very back wall. You walk down a couple of aisles, set up with all kinds of chips and things for picnics and stuff, and I found this hiding. It wasn't very orderly, and there was just stuff everywhere, and I saw this sticking out, and I picked it up for my husband when we go on vacation and at home. And I love the fun pattern on this tray, and it's really cute with the watermelons and the lemons. Reminds me of summer. It's one of the first things that I picked up. I grabbed myself Ready Wipes, and it is a 50 count. Just to have on hand in the car, I have kids and a husband, and you should have wipes all the time. I also picked up this really cute water bottle and all the red, white, and blue holiday colors. And I can use this all summer long. I've been drinking about three bottle sizes of water like this a day. Now, my mom had the old fashioned green or and yellow Tupperware one. I actually found the lid that goes with it because sometimes you can't and it's that nice orange color pitcher for Kool-Aids and things and I absolutely love this. Some really cool summer stuff out. And I have never seen these napkin holders before and I have some metal ones in my cabinet that I stick my packets for seasoning and flavoring dishes and I store them inside of it but this is really nice and I'm going to use it on my dinner table for napkins. I had a ceramic one that fell and broke so I figured that would be a lot better and not have to worry about glass. And I am going to be doing a chicken broccoli casserole for one of my Dollar Tree dinners and I picked up the chicken that I needed. Garlic press. I have never seen these at the Dollar Tree before, at least not in mine. Every time I go into the kitchen section, there's something new and fun. And I, you know I like that red accent if you follow my channel on a regular basis. I have two bags to get to. I never just have one bag at the Dollar Tree. Very rarely. Now, I have never seen these oven-baked fudge mint cookies. They're like the Thin Mint. And my husband loves fudge mint cookies. And I got a whole box of them. They're 9 ounces and it feels heavy so there looks like there's a lot of cookies in here. And I'll let you know how good they are in my next Dollar Tree haul. First bag done. On to the next one. In the 
summer section, my husband's grandson. I picked up this really cute sun hat for him to, to give to his daughter for the baby. Now, my friend from a chick plus three, I had mentioned I had gotten paper unicorn straws. And if they can't find them, I bought her a pack. So she'll have to send me an email. And I'll find a way to talk to her privately if I can. So when you watch, please contact me on Facebook. You can go into messages at, and uh, just search my name and I should pop up and send me a message. And if you would like these, I will send them to you. And I got a pizza pan. This is going to be for our craft that I'm going to be doing in the future. And I've seen on Pinterest people using these for all kinds of great things. They even use the laundry baskets or the mesh garbage cans and make little cute end tables for outdoors. I picked up these and they're the fur flops and uh, I thought they were adorable and it's my favorite pattern of the leopard print because if you know me you know I love Duff Leopard and I've loved Duff Leopard since I was 11 years old. I've seen him twice in concert and Joe is my man and I listen to them just about every day and usually they're older stuff 70s 80s and some of the early 90s and the leopard print is fun, and I just absolutely love these. Over in Holiday, I love this wood sign with the old style bunt. And if you're not a fan of the glitter, just spray it with hairspray, and the glitter will stay right on it. That is really pretty. And I had these last year, and I don't know what happened to them, but I found the blue ones, and I picked up another star. I'm going to put that on my buffet, and just going to sit there. It's super cute. Now I found paper straws for myself with the red stars, patriotic. You get an 18 count, and they're just real high-end looking. They would be fun at parties. I've been getting all different styles and patterns, just kind of stocking them up to keep them stockpiled in my house. I love to have things on hand when I need them. Now to go with the plates from the other haul from the other day, I found the buffalo check. I love how Dollar Tree is bringing buffalo check from season to season. And they were managed to get it into the summer season because you usually see buffalo check only in the winter time or the fall and these plates are beautiful and they'll look nice with a layered look with the truck that I picked up and then the flag napkins and then the straws when we go on our vacation near 4th of July. When I go on vacation I will be doing videos on how I set up our suite, our menu for the week I'll do, and I'll be doing dinners and how we grill and just how we spend our time while we're on vacation. Now the flip-flops, I didn't realize my kids' feet grew and I picked Jacqueline up these watermelon flip-flops and look how adorable they are. They are so fun for the summer. I just love Dollar Tree flip-flops and I always buy two. That way they have them and if one breaks, I have a spare set because flip-flops tend to sell out. I also picked up and the crafters corners cross stitch fun. It's a cupcake and it's a good way to get children to learn how to sew. I used to do the cross stitch and latch hooking when I was a child. And that reminded me of the lion latch hook that I did back in the 70s. There was a table with some Mother's Day stuff up so you can make Mother's Day gift baskets. And you can make amazing high-end gift baskets from Dollar Tree products and the bath sponges are so cute. It's a rose 
and I really like it a lot. They have different colors and I grabbed the pink one. I saw someone haul the scissors and they have them with patterns on them. How fun is that? These I will keep and set aside for when I'm doing my crafting. So I have kitchen shear shears and I have a backup set of my Betty Crocker shears. But these are going to be especially for when I do wreaths and things. This is for the pool on vacation. Last year they couldn't have anything in the pool. But I think you're going to be able to this year. It's a two piece set. Racks. And it comes with the ball. You catch the ball and the ball's one of those balls that you splash in the pool. The cute little rackets. They're red and blue. And the children's. I picked up an extra one of my blue plates because I noticed there was a chip on one. And I like to have at least five because sometimes we have a guest over. And that way they have a plate for their dessert. And for my husband's grandson, I have never seen the little kids flip flops at the Dollar Tree before. Look how tiny and cute the little shoes for him. And the grandson, he's going to look so cute in the hat and the shoes. His daughter's going to love them for his grandson. How cute. And really great stuff. And my last item is a cord holder craft in the crafter's corner section. And I have never seen these before. And I picked up this one. And I picked up the sloth, and there was a few left, and I grabbed these, and I thought they were really cute and something fun to do on a rainy day for your cell phone cords. This concludes my Dollar Tree haul for today. I hope you enjoyed everything that I picked out to bring to you, so you know what to look for when you go Dollar Tree shopping, and you have an idea what they have in their stores. Every day there is something new, and I like to bring the best of the best to you guys, so you can pick out what you need for your household and what I don't use I like to make little gift baskets for my friends I give them one out to my friend Kate and my friend Jennifer and they garden and they absolutely love the baskets that I made them and I'm so happy and pleased that I can make them happy like that if you are new here thank you so much for stopping by I really appreciate you clicking on my link and giving my video a try and thank you for watching all the way through Let's click on that red subscribe word, give this video a big thumbs up, and tap on the bell so YouTube will notify you when I upload new content. And don't forget to subscribe because I have a collaboration video coming up, as well as some other exciting videos for extreme cleaning my laundry area. I haven't forgotten about that one, people. It will get done. And some Dollar Tree dinners that are going to be coming up.